Hello, my name's Maddie. Welcome to my storyland and number eight in a countdown of ten sad poems. The author of If Tomorrow Starts Without Me is unknown, but the poem is generally attributed to David Romano. The poem is a simple one, but it is deep, sincere, and brimming with emotion. It's about death and grief, certainly, but mostly it's about love. And today, it is my pleasure to read it to you. Are you ready? Then let's begin. If Tomorrow Starts Without Me, written, perhaps, by David Romano. When tomorrow starts without me, and I'm not there to see, if the sun should rise and find your eyes all filled with tears for me. I wish so much you wouldn't cry the way you did today, while thinking of the many things we didn't get to say. I know how much you love me, as much as I love you, and each time that you think of me I know you'll miss me too. But when tomorrow starts without me, please try to understand that an angel came and called my name and took me by the hand and said my place was ready in heaven far above and that I'd have to leave behind all those I dearly love. But as I turned to walk away, a tear fell from my eye. For all my life I'd always thought I didn't want to die. I had so much to live for, so much left yet to do. It seemed almost impossible that I was leaving you. I thought of all the yesterdays, the good ones and the bad. I thought of all the love we shared and all the fun we had. If I could relive yesterday just even for a while, I'd say goodbye and kiss you and maybe see you smile. But then I fully realized that this could never be, for emptiness and memories would take the place of me. And when I thought of worldly things I might miss come tomorrow, I thought of you. And when I did, my heart was filled with sorrow. But when I walked through heaven's gates, I felt so much at home when God looked down and smiled at me from his great golden throne. He said, This is eternity, and all I've promised you. Today your life on earth is past, but here life starts anew. I promise no tomorrow, but today will always last, and since each day is the same way, there's no longing for the past. You have been so faithful, so trusting, and so true, though there were times you did some things you knew you shouldn't do. But you have been forgiven, and now, at last, you're free. So won't you come and take my hand and share my life with me? So when tomorrow starts without me, don't think we're far apart. For every time you think of me, I'm right here, in your heart. And with that, I bid you farewell. I hope you enjoyed the poem. Perhaps I'll see you again. I certainly hope so. Until then. Hello, Maddie here. Thanks for watching me read stuff. There are lots more videos of me reading stuff over on my channel. And if there's other stuff you'd really like me to read, just let me know in the comment section below. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons, and I upload new videos all the time, so maybe hit the bell icon too, so you can get notified when new stuff comes out. Thanks again for watching, and see you next time.